Dear MDA brothers and sisters, it has come to my attention that the ship James has won the now meaningless piece of shit MVP award. In all seriousness, nobody, and I mean nobody, should be able to get away with taking steroids and be rewarded with an MVP award. That's just fucking bullshit. If Randy Ramirez got caught, there is no reason why the ship James has not been banned yet from the NBA, except that you have to say that David Stern is hiding the truth. What the fuck? I will prove to you that the NBA will go bankrupt if the fuckholders win the championship this year. I am about to present a scientific study measuring the level of crappiness of the city of Crapville. Let's take a look at Boston. Holy shit. That building is nice. Is that a snapshot of Paul Revere? Man, just seeing this makes me proud to be an American. And look at all those championship banners. Now let's look at LA. Whoa, look at the size of that fucking monster. That's got to be 200 stories high. 14 MDA championships. Sweet Jesus, that's fucking 14 MDA championships. No wonder why these two cities deserve to win half of the MDA titles. And now let's look at Crapville. Goddamn, this place is so fucking depressing. It makes me so nervous that I can't even take a shit in peace. Crapville is a third world country in America, and yet these poor citizens of Crapville somehow manage to throw their money into the pocket of the ship James. And what does the ship James give them in return? A fucking ridiculous per game ritual? Refusing to play in the last game of the NBA season? Fuck this injustice! While guys like Kobe Bryant and Lee Wade give all their money to charity, the ship James is becoming more and more inconsiderate to the needs of the unfortunate. MVP my fucking ass. Wait a minute. Am I still stuck in this fucking shithole? Fuck this. I need something to cheer me up before I shoot myself. Thank you. I'm in Orlando now, and now I feel relieved. There you have it. The NBA is in the process of helping the fuckholders win the NBA titles, but as you saw from my scientific study, it is useless and even detrimental to the NBA to have the crapville fuckholders win the NBA championship this year. My heart and prayers go out to Kevin Garnett for a speedy recovery from his season-ending injury. Instead of taking a shortcut like the ship James and taking drugs or sucking the cocks of the NBA officials, KG became a good basketball player through hard work and determination, and for that, I respect a guy like KG. I would like to thank all my members for their support towards this important cause. It is important that we let David Stern know that we refuse to believe in the hype around the ship James. Shit. I swear that if Kevin Durant took the drugs the ship James was taking, he'd be miles ahead of that steroid-infected fucking piece of dog steaming shit that came out of a 17-year-old bitch. If that bitch was a good mother, perhaps she'd teach that brainless overgrown fucker that you can't get a shortcut through life by taking drugs. I pray that one day, David Stern will have no choice but to get rid of the ship James, and then we'd have basketball return to what it should be. An enjoyable team sport, and not a hey look at me, you can't stop me because I have the refs on my side type of sport. Thank you all, and good night.